Absolutely beautiful day here in New Jersey, and we're here at Jackson Skate Park, the local skate park around here. Haven't been here this year, and we were shocked to see that there's no fence anymore. I don't know why the fence has been taken down. No clue, but it was a lot easier to get in. Didn't have to focus through that little hole, especially with so many people being here. Just kidding. There's absolutely nobody here besides us and Joey. So we're going to have a quick little session. And uh, good news is Maddie is back on his bike after the wisdom teeth are out. Like he can actually fully ride now. So we'll be able to start filming more consistently. Um, let me fill you in. This week's super hectic. We have a very special guest flying in that I'm really excited to see. I haven't seen him in a really long time. Um, it's going to be the international bad boy, Ronnie Surge. We're picking him up from the airport tomorrow night. And yeah, it's going to be an awesome week. He's going to be here for 10 days. The reason why he's here is because because Vinny is getting married on June 11th, so he's going to be hanging out with us all the way up to that point. Uh, it's just going to be non-stop action, I can promise you that, um, as soon as he gets over his jet lag. But we're going to get started straight away and get riding. Maddie wants to do the craziest gap ever. Let me tell you guys about it. I'm not actually doing the craziest gap ever. <laughs> but what I was saying is I had a dream the other night, about a week ago, I would say, that I cleared, well, I wanted to clear it, coming from the landing of this box jump right here into the half pipe. And in my dream, all the way over there, like, <laughs> There's a fence around it. I was like, you can't possibly do that. And we just showed up and I'm like, where did the fence go? And I'm thinking, I'm like, wow, I've got all the runway yeah. in the world right now. There's a lot, but this is still. But it's still impossible. So I'm jump, not going to try it's it. It's like a steep bank. And then that is so far. That I, I, like if I had to estimate how far it is, I'm going to say it's close to 40 feet. It's pretty nuts that he came here and the fence is down. But yeah, it's not happening today, especially since his first day riding back in. So what's your first trick going to be back on the bike uh, now that you have... Um, I don't know, your wisdom's been removed and you're clear to go. I feel much lighter. You feel lighter? Mm -hmm. All right, so what do you want to do, big air or something? Do the biggest big boost you can over this little box jump. Okay. I, I just want to see the highest you can possibly go. Since you're so light, you got nothing holding you down anymore. But less wisdom, as you said. <laughs> yes, a lot less wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Joe, what? you have wax? Ooh, why was up? What if you did like 180 pegs on here? Yeah. And then go into there or like do something out of it. Oh, like you're saying on the flat? pegs. Yeah, that could be pretty cool. Maybe like, you think you lift up to like a disaster? It's a big 180 pegs, but yeah, I think it's totally I'm doable. I'm that. up for it. I think it's a really cool idea. This might be the first time Maddie ever applied wax in his life, by the way, guys. I actually don't know what I'm doing right now, <laughs> by the way. I'm usually just asked Dom to do it. Yeah. That's pretty cool. I landed really It was nice. High in it. All right, this time he's going to try to 180 out. Nice, Matt. That was really cool. Good use, of course, so far. You got anything new? Yeah. I'm, uh, I'm going to use the same grinding spot. It's the best ledge here. I'm going to pump across this. Go feeble, hard 180, fakey whip. <laughs> That's serious. Sound like GR out here. <laughs> sound, like, sound like Street King. <laughs> Listen, man. I don't even think GR would be interested in this one. We'll see. <laughs> he could it, do it. Don't get me wrong. He could do it first try. I'll go, and then, and then this I'll, is something else. We'll see what happens. So me and Maddie just came to the conclusion we're idiots, and um, we've been here since the fence has been gone. When we were here filming the video with the Insta360 Go 2, the fence was definitely gone. We're just idiots. It is what it is. <laughs> yeah. All right, that was not what was on the menu, but it was kind of cool. Dude, that was a sick clip, man. <laughs> Pretty proud of that. I like that. That was really good. Dude, I'm glad for I not having the wisdom, man, it's looking like you're you know what? gaining something else you here. You see how long I floated, even though I had no speed? Mm -hmm. Stayed up in the air just a little bit longer. So you think lightweight? Yeah, lightweight. Did you ever grind across this whole thing? When I was young. You did? When I was young. How'd you get it? How, where'd you go after that? Probably just case the edge of the roller and just... It's just That's crazy. Hit it. it looks pretty cool. I mean, want to show you? I feel like we have to. I'll show you. Yeah, let's do that. I'll show you what I, I'll show you what I did when I was young. But we have to. We can't not not use this ledge like this. <laughs> That's probably what I did. <laughs> nice. That was really cool. Oh, so was that. Do you think I could like what? Pull out two seventy from here. Two seventy to flat. Yeah. Maybe. I think it's a good little test spot to do it on. Oh, yeah. That'd be awesome, actually. So Maddie's talking about going up this transition, trying to use it like a wall in a way to jump off of and like land fakie on here. If you could do fakie and then half cab in, yeah, I'll, I'll try and that would be sick. That'd be cool. This this was like perfect, 
learning. Might as well. I mean, the it's coping not. sticks out a bunch on this one, so it could pop you it's out, which would be nice. Oh, that is beautiful. I love it. Oh! <laughs> no, that, was, that was what I was scared of during my fakie. <laughs> That's what I was scared of. I didn't want to do that. I was trying to fight it without jersey hopping, and I was like, you can do it! Yeah. And it just came out. <laughs> Might as well give you guys a quick injury update. Um, my knees are still a little messed up. But besides that, though, the hand is feeling uh, pretty good for the most part. It's a little sore, but I can live with it. All right, here we go. Yes, Matt. That was so cool. <laughs> this is not a tire ad. But maybe it is. I don't know. Could really show how see how good the Kieran Riley tire holds up. <laughs> Maddie's about to uh, purposely wear this tire down. I'm gonna skid all, all the way around this thing, Tokyo drift style. You, you think it's gonna be like your scooter days? You're gonna get a nice little flat spot. You're gonna be clunking around. Dun, 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 dun. So mad. Yeah, I actually fun. really enjoyed that though. When I remember like being at the skate park, I used to have an abundance of yak wheels. And I would just purposely go skid around the skate park just so you'd ride and everybody would hear you coming. Oh, worse. G -g 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 Nothing worse than that. Look at that stance. <laughs> nice, Matt. I hope it was worth it. <laughs> Gotta be it, right? I'm, I'm, I'm assuming that's it. I actually didn't wear it down bad. nearly as much as I expected it to. It's Especially perfect. on rough concrete. I can do so many more skids. <laughs> yes, you can. It is not a scooter channel just yet, guys. Matt is coming back to his roots, so. Let's see if he's a bike rider or a scooter. We'll see what happens first. Ah! He's a scooter. I can't. <laughs> scooter. Okay. Bike hang five this way. Scooter hang five that way. Wow. The, the harder one the first. I like it. Oh, uh, now the pressure's on. But he's gonna go to his comfort zone right now. Nice, Matt. So I just want to talk about the shirt I'm wearing today. As you guys can see, greater than the game. So this is a friend of mine named Ryan. I actually met him probably two or three years ago. We ended up doing like a little podcast interview together and he was nice enough to drop the shirt off at the bike shop. And it reminded me to be able to give him a little bit of a shout out on here. I just want to do it because he's an awesome guy and he's doing something really cool on Instagram. If you guys go to the Instagram for greater than the game, you could see that he posts up a ton of inspiring sports stories. So if you guys are into sports, if you guys are into positive news, make sure you guys go give him a follow. And so Ryan, thank you for dropping off the shirt, man. I really appreciate it and I hope everything's going good for you. There's a gap I just found. Oh god. Yeah. No, you honestly you should be saying Why that. were you looking over there? Because you, you, not... you can see it. Come on. Add it together. What are you gonna do? He's going to jump into that yes. banana thing? From the top part. Dang it. Does that even make sense to you? Is that possible? From here? Kind yes. Of. When I walk up there, I want to say no. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> huh. Huh. It's doable, but it's, it is doable. it's a it's ballsy just, move. It's... You can land in a ghost feebs <laughs> and just run it. I'm either gonna do a ghost feeble or a ghost smith. You kinda just pick your poison. No, you won't do smith. That's it. You're really well, you're gonna over jump it. You're gonna overjump it. Like if, no. if you clear it, I don't think I'm gonna be able to like That's crazy though. Like isn't I'll it? I'll eye it up real quick. Alright, you can eye it up. But no pressure, no pressure. But here's his first eye up. Hey, I don't know what you think. It is one hundred percent doable, but the question is, is it worth it? That's what we're gonna find out right now. Another angle. Oh, oh I even stepped out here because I thought I was safe. No. All right, since you're on a feeble hard 180 kick today, let's do feeble hard 180 on this big ledge that's directly behind you. And then you got to do something off of this ledge, but it has to involve your pegs. So it's saying feeble 180 up. And then, and then something, something off of here. this ledge right here, but it has to involve your pegs on the way out. Hmm. Choose wisely. We'll see what happens. <laughs> that was so bad. Whoa. That was insane. I don't know what happened. You and me both. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Thanks. Yeah. How hot is it today? 98, 98.7. It's pretty close. It's like 95 today, actually. It is. That's Fahrenheit for all you people right out there now. in the Celsius. We haven't felt this in so long. And it's been hot, but this is just. It is. 
There's a little breeze, but not enough. There's no breeze. I haven't felt a breeze. There's a little breeze. I don't know a breeze you feel. Tiny, tiny, tiny. That's just the wind of me crashing coming by you. Maybe it is. Keep Here it up. Some more. Just Keep it up. Do some Keep, for you. Just do it. That one was right. really good. Let's do that one again. Thanks. Ow! This is fun, man. So. Right? You having so much oh, fun? This is so good. Because the final trick, and then we get to go pick up Benny. All right, let's go get Ben. We're gonna go in the air conditioning where he is too. Ben, we're coming, buddy. <laughs> we're almost there. For Ben. For Ben. <laughs> I'll take it, man. If you would have landed anything, I would have took it. I had pegs 270 in my head, and then I did pegs fakey, and I was like, turn the way you're supposed to out, and I was like, that's way too much effort right now. <laughs> like, Dude, well, don't blow this. <laughs> don't worry about it. I was very lenient. It's we too got, hot. We're we have to go get your dog, Scott. Yeah, we do. He's, I right. can hear him barking. What, Ben? Ben, <laughs> okay. ben, we're coming. <laughs> ben, <Let's go. laughs> There he is. He's chilling. Hey, bud. How's your bed? I was going to go pick you up, but I think life is good for you right now, man. Look at that you got. You got something cool? <laughs> do you want me to take him or I don't know. or do you want to stay because like he looks pretty content he's been good this is your dream right here he only peed once he's got a fun new toy that's off a bike rack I know what it is <laughs> as long as there's nothing that can break off and he could swallow it then he'll be okay <laughs> oh, no, I'm watching him so do you like Ben he's cool. who's, who's cuter him or Eddie right now tell us the truth twins come on tell us the truth twins <laughs> Well, if one of them fell off a boat, which one are you going to save, Ben uh, or Eddie? Um, ben, because Eddie can swim. Yeah, <laughs> I was hoping you were going to say that. <laughs> so what do you think about little Ben? He's a cute. He is cute, right? Oh, yeah, he's a cute. I think I'm going to leave him here for now. I think we might puppy-proof this, make sure there's nothing that he can get into in this area, and just see if we can make it work. So we're going to check in a little bit. So okay? we puppy-proofed it so he cannot sneak through. We have uh, these little walls built up right here to keep him in. And hopefully this works. He seems really happy, so we're going to try it. So we are going to be leaving Ben here for the day. We're going to try it out, have my wife go to work with him. We'll see how it goes, and we'll keep on checking it. Just show you guys how Benny's new life is coming, and so far, so good. We've been really enjoying being around him. So guys, that's it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.